retired contractor from Round Rock isn't ready to hang it up just yet. He's invented a drill that helps bring water to people in places of the world that need it the most. He already has several patents under his belt, but he thinks his most recent will make a big difference. I sat down with him to talk about his Patent for Humanity Award. First, tell me about the patent. How long have you been working on it? 2015, I started thinking about it again when I understood that there were so many people dying in Africa and India and, and uh, South America, and uh, there was no reason for them to. The way to do it was drill reverse flow instead of direct circulation. One water goes down the drill stem and comes up the outside. The other one, the water goes down the outside and comes up the drill stem. There's a big difference. I'm sure you don't want to go into all of that. Did it surprise you there wasn't already something out there like this? There's a mathematical and engineering problem with airlift reverse flow. Uh, you have to have a certain percentage submersion of the airline in order to get the uh, drill to work. I think I've resolved that, and it's working real well. So what's this been like? Is it really rewarding? The biggest reward was uh, when I made my first trip to India because they had drilled a few wells before I got there. A young girl there, uh, she was so excited that we had drilled her a well. You know, she wanted to grab my hand and take me in to meet her mother and, uh, and feed me breakfast. And Crawford's charity is called One Million Wells. It's unique because he has reduced the cost of drilling and uses inexpensive materials for the system. So it costs less than $2,000 to complete a manually powered drilling system. Plus an entire community can use the same rig to drill dozens of wells, which saves them money overall. It's not a quick process to get a patent approved for inventions like this. To file for a patent, you have to keep a thorough record. Make sure the invention is new and pay $50 $1,500 to the United States Patent and Trademark Office. Then it takes about 22 months to get the patent approved.